Yes, all right. So um, um, the question is, uh, for the past few months, they were telling me, you've traveled to over 15 different cities in America, and you flew. Who is sponsoring you? Now they want to know, why is it that I fly a lot? I said, look, I wish I, you want to sponsor me? That would be sweet. I wish I have someone who sponsors my program. If someone wants my service, buy me a ticket. If I have to fly, I fly over, get some place to sleep, food to eat. That's it. I don't, I, I don't have any. So, okay. Um, so, that's what they did. Eventually, they have to leave me. I'm a U.S. citizen. I know my right. I have few lawyers that I stand by. In case of anything, I give them a call and they come over. So they realize that they're dealing with someone that is not just someone. So finally, finally they let me go. They let me go. So I said, okay, what? I opened, I said, you have a phone? Can I have your phone? He gave it to me. I opened my YouTube. Go watch it. This is my name, Sheikh Mohammed Awal. You daddy. See, my life is like a book, open book, all over the place. So I'm, I'm not going to hide. And in all my talks, if I'm done, I have to pray to United States. I have to pray to America. Because I live in America. My children born in America. We have a lot of masjid in America. At the time of Eid, the Muslims who live in America, they send money back home to buy cows. And Rakumi and Raguna. For Leia. So you have to make dua for America. Yeah. We live there. It's, it's, it's even haram to make bad dua for the place that you lived. The messenger never made a dangerous dua to destroy the Meccans in spite of what they did. You know what happened in Taif? They broke his teeth in Taif. The angel said, Ya Rasulullah, Allah is ready. We push the stone, destroy. He said, no, if these guys didn't worship Allah, their great-grandchildren will worship Allah. Well, the last time I went to Hajj, a few years ago, I went to Taif. I said, Allah Akbar. All of them are Muslims, alhamdulillah. Had it been he destroyed them or he called damnation upon them. So I don't call damnation upon America. We have good people in America. Faith, faithful. We build masjid all over the place. We buy masjid all over the place. In England, the same, all over the world. So we have to pray that inshallah, maybe Allah in his wisdom along the way, they might see the light and become Muslim. Because the Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam said, Islam will rise from the West. And I believe the moment America accepts Islam in total, the whole world will accept Islam. Because when America says jump, we say, how high should we jump? We ask them how high. So, but they still have that misconception. 